Engineers are problem solvers. A hospital in Ohio approached UT's Institute of Agriculture and asked for help in finding a better way to deliver light therapy to patients. The lights were clunky and in the way, and constantly moving them was time-consuming for doctors and nurses, and patients weren't getting the full benefits of therapy. Because right now the patients can't get the treatments that they need, and the hospital really can't work with what the devices that they have because they're just not usable, and so we're making them usable. UTIA students built a system where the lamps could be fastened to wall or table mounts, which made access easier for hospital staff and patients. And uh, like the Velcro is just sort of a, a first try for us. So it is exciting and it is like it's neat to know that we can actually make something that could go on to help a lot of people. These are biosystems engineering majors at UTIA. The undergraduate program prepares graduates to work with environmental, biological, or agricultural systems. And get to know them, but then once I got into biosystems, I got to have a much smaller class size, I got to know my professors really well, and um, got to really delve into some areas and some incredibly diverse areas. Biosystems engineering is a challenging major, lots of math and science. I have no idea what this stuff is on this board behind me. But as you might imagine, these graduates are in high demand. And many of them have jobs before graduation with a whole range of different types of companies, agencies, everything from engineering consulting firms to machinery companies, food companies, uh, pool chemicals, just about anything you can imagine our students have done and are very successful at that. These biosystems engineers were part of a competition at UT. They pack sand, soil, clay, and rocks, creating a bioretention system that might help with stormwater cleanup. Your sandbox is going to be the environment. Dr. Julie Carrier says a problem that needs a solution is also a learning opportunity and possible future career for biosystem students. And students learn and have the confidence with this degree to be able to really tackle complex environmental problems. In a few months, UTIA will graduate a new group of talented young people in this field. Biosystems engineers build a better future for themselves career-wise and the world around them. This is Charles Denny reporting.